What's going on guys? Beastly Gamer here. Welcome to the channel. Thank you guys for joining me today. This video is dedicated to all the fanboys because I'm pretty sure it's going to be fanning those fanboy flames uh, with the information I'm about to reveal to you guys. But at the end of every year, there's always tallies, there's always questions. And one question was, which console had the most quality exclusives in 2016? Now, if you look back, there was a myriad of amazing games on Xbox, on PlayStation, and will we say Nintendo? I'm, we'll go ahead and say Nintendo as well. Uh, and only one can win. There can only be one ring to rule them all. In 2016, I'll drop a link in the description. PS4 was a console with the most quality exclusives in 2016, according to Metacritic anyway. Metacritic put together its annual industry summary revealing that the PlayStation 4 was a console with the most quality exclusives in 2016. According to the site's data, the system landed 13 exclusives with a Metascore of 75 or above, while the Wii U and Xbox One could muster just 3 and 4 respectively. To its credit, the Nintendo 3DS performed best in this area, though only 57 games were rated for the handheld overall, compared to the gigantic 445 on Sony's home console. The average Metacritic for all PS4 games reached 69.1, with four titles surpassing the coveted 90 milestone. Uncharted 4 Thieves N was the highest rated title of the year, topping out at 93 with over 100 critics attributed. Another strong year for Sony's flagship format then, and it looks like things will only get better as we move into 2017. So congratulations to Sony. As, as per Metacritic, this is not as per Beastly Gamer, even though I happen to also agree that PlayStation kind of knocked it out of the park this year with their exclusives. This doesn't go through the list of games, but according to this article, there were 13 exclusives with a meta score of 75 or above, and I think that's pretty damn good that's averaging over one per month. Uh, you guys let me know what you think in the comments below. This is, of course, a very subjective subject. I know a lot of fanboys will be going crazy right now, but I want to know what you think. What were your favorite exclusives of the year and what consoles were they on? What were your favorite exclusives of the year and what console did they happen to be on? I'd be smitten to know. I hope you guys enjoyed this little update video. If you did, give a thumbs up to show support for my channel. Join the Facebook group. Follow me on Twitter. I'm always tweeting crazy stuff at crazy people, so it might be entertaining to you and you can support my channel at beastlygamer.com merry christmas and happy new year everybody i'm the beastly gamer and i'll see you guys next time